employing a risk-based vaccination strategy. We shall start with outbreak districts along the porous borders, uh, Tanzania, DRC, and Kenya. We shall then go to the outbreak districts where it is predominantly communal grazing and watering areas. Then we shall go to outbreak districts along the livestock transit stock routes. This is a science-based strategy. Previously, we were keeping a blind eye on the DVO charging farmers for vaccinating the animals. Because we used to send money to districts for vaccination and DVOs complained that the cows were not prioritizing vaccination and you are charging farmers. So we changed and I want to be corrected PS. We send this money to your phones making sure that when we give you 80,000 doses of vaccine we accordingly give you money to vaccinate the 80 doses of vaccine. So there should be no excuse for charging farmers. And I want to repeat we are going to have a problem. And to the media and everybody, there is nobody who is allowed to import vaccine, FMD vaccine, in the country. So next week or so, we will get 3 million doses from Egypt. Yes. And at a much, much, much lower price. So I want to thank him for that uh, cooperation and diplomatic uh, link he created for us. So for the first time, DVOs, the 9 million doses that the PS has told you between a span of one month, I think it's a big achievement for that sector. I doubt, I doubt if we've ever gotten it. Never.